The Peter Cushing Doctor Who movies are a bit of an oddity in the world of Doctor Who. They aren't canon, so they just act as flashy, simplified retellings of Doctor Who episodes. Personally, I quite enjoy them. Due to the fact that very little of the Doctor's history was known when they were made, they made up a lot of lore that's no longer canon. This includes the Doctor being a human scientist named Doctor Who, him having built the TARDIS, and both Susan and Barbara being his granddaughters. There are only two movies in this series, Doctor Who and the Daleks, and Daleks Invasion Earth 2150 AD. But I think I have found a secret prequel. That's right. And that prequel comes in the form of At the Earth's Core. At the Earth's Core is a 1976 movie produced by Amicus Productions, who also did the Doctor Who movies. It was an adaptation of Edgar Rice Burroughs' book of the same name following the success of Amicus's adaptation of The Land That Time Forgot. It was Amicus's second to last film before closing down, though it's sometimes referred to as the last because their real last film, The People That Time Forgot, which as you may have guessed, is a sequel to The Land That Time Forgot, wasn't released until after they folded. American International Pictures, who had previously distributed both The Land That Time Forgot and At The Earth's Core, took all the credit for the movie. But back to Doctor Who. This movie stars Peter Cushing as Dr. Abner Perry, who goes to the Earth's core with his assistant David Eines and finds a whole new world beneath the crust. Well, the plot of the movie isn't super important, but the ending is. At the end of the movie, we see the drill machine they used to get to the center of the Earth coming up through the ground at none other than the White House. As it comes up, we see two guards freaking out. So here's my admittedly pretty out there theory. The guards, as well as the rest of the White House security, sees this giant drill come up out of the ground at the White House. What do they think? Holy shit! Some terrorists are trying to attack the White House by tunneling in using a giant drill! So, Dr. Perry and David Eines get labeled as terrorists by the US government and must flee with their families and move to the UK, though it's very possible that they split paths to make themselves harder to find. So, Dr. Perry needs to find out what to name himself and his family. Who could he be? Well... He could be who? I know it sounds weird, but at the same time, who's just born with the last name who? It sounds like something you'd come up with if you were trying to hide your identity and also weren't very creative. So yeah, that's my theory. At the Earth's Core is a prequel to the 60s Peter Cushing Doctor Who movies. What do you think? Tell me in the comments. Subscribing is good for your eyes. Bye.